it has been almost eight months since I posted a YouTube video on this channel. But ladies and gentlemen, we are back. What's up guys, it is AB, coming to you live with another banger video. Today we are reviewing Jack's batting gloves. This is requested for me to review in the previous video. If you haven't seen the last review video, we reviewed Bruce Bolt batting gloves. You can see that right here or in the description below. Big news, you guys. Not only are we releasing this review video, later this week, we are releasing another review video. So yeah, stay tuned. If you are excited for the baseball season right around the corner, or you are in love with the game of baseball, hit that subscribe button. It is totally free. You can unsubscribe whenever you want. All we do around here is baseball related content. If you are new here, I will be rating the gloves off of looks, feel, and durability. And finally, after all that, I'll give them an overall score. Remember, this is my personal review and opinion, so feel free to disagree. Jax Bangles was so kind to send me a pair of their newly released Jax Model 1 Pro Cuffs. You can find these gloves in the description below. Huge shout out to Jax for sending me these. We'll do an inspection of the glove, and then we'll go outside to hit. So, without further ado, let's dive right in. All right, here we go. Jax Bangles. Wow, that was a clean rip. What ta da! Wow, look at that packaging. I love that. White is the color. Look at those. That is nice. I like this little seal design. Look at these. Wow. So we have the white model ones here. First thing I noticed when I open these gloves is it is a great logo. I love that Jax batting gloves logo. I love the word Jax at the bottom. Another thing I noticed is it has ventilation for your hand right here so you don't get too sweaty. Ventilation holes right here like normal batting gloves. Another ventilation on the thumb. Get the side protector, uh, so no blisters right there. Then it's got more padding in the web between your thumb and your index finger right here to prevent blisters. All right, let's hear that Chris take off. All right, hand is going in the glove. Look at that, oh man. First thing I feel is they are super light to the touch. I love that. Firmly grasp the wrist, which I also like, wow. I love the feel of these. They're not too blocky and bricky on your hands. Very lightweight. I love the design. They're just so clean in the middle. White all around, platinum white. So these are made of Cabretta leather, really commonly used amongst batting gloves. These are not really heavy at all. The perfect amount of weight, I would say. Another thing I noticed, oh, your hand goes from open to closed. I don't know if the camera can pick this up. There's these little stripes right here on your knuckles and they go from closed so like this and then when you grip your bat open to have breathable knuckles right here that is sick that glove's really going to help combat those temperatures in spring and summer and dim down that sweating so you can really grip your bat that glove is very lightweight has a lot of mesh so your hand can breathe so after a five at bat your hand won't smell like cheese i bet when you're running the bases it feels real nice and lightweight in your hands if you are still here hit that like and subscribe button now we're going to go on hitting we are swinging the Easton ADB Project 3, 33 ounce. Uh, let's put these gloves on, shall we? Woo! All right, first swing, let's do it. Oh, man. Oh, dude, these things are comfortable. God, these things are comfortable. These are probably the most comfortable gloves I've ever put on my hands. I like how they're so lightweight and I can still grip the bat whilst they're being comfortable. And just all around it, just a great feel on my hand. Yeah, these things are super lightweight, great feel. Great feel. But on the durability aspect, I already got some shaving on the gloves. I don't know if you can see that. I already got a little bit of shaving on the gloves here on my, my bottom hand glove. Mind you, I have worn these in game before, so that's why they're a little bit dirty. That is most likely where the shaving came from, probably from the gains, but I've only played a couple games. i only played like two, three games. They're already shaving, I don't know. Still way better than most gloves on the market. The padding right here on the bottom side of the glove helps huge, huge. 
makes such a difference when you have the padding there versus not. I mean, if you don't have the padding there, you get huge blisters. And I promise you, that, that is the worst place to get a blister. Worst. On my top hand glove, my right hand glove, uh, no shaving at all, just mostly on my bottom hand. Besides that, just the biggest thing is the comfortability. I mean, these are just, it's just like having a cloud on your hand when you're swinging the bat. It's fantastic. Let's do a little belly swing, a little belly action. Let's do a little Shohei out here. Oh! All right, for my final swing, I'm gonna imitate Javier Baez. Starting off with the looks, I'd probably have to say these are the coolest looking batting gloves I've ever seen. Love the logo, that's a, such a nice design. A jacks on the bottom, and then just these cool ventilation pockets, just really tying the design. I love the white design, it's perfect. So for the overall looks rating, I have to give it a 10. So now looking on the feel, oh man, these gloves are feeling nice. I mean, I think they're really soft to the touch, still protect your hand well. They are thick, but not on the side of thick where it's like suffocating your hand and where you can't even grip your bat. It is honestly the perfect amount of weight on your hand. So for feel, another 10. Finally, for durability, I'm honestly not sure about the durability of these gloves. I've worn them through basically half my high school season and they have a lot of wear and tear already pretty dirty on one of the gloves and all around it seems to be getting weathered a, a good bit but I guess these gloves will last you a good two to four months on average and uh, a great lifespan for gloves I have to give the durability a seven flat that would give Jack's batting gloves a final score of a straight nine that is a fantastic glove folks Keep in mind, batting gloves are like anything else in baseball. It is all about preference. Hopefully watching this video helped you out. That is it for this video. If you guys have any other video ideas you'd like to see, please leave it in the comments below. If you'd like to see more baseball content, make sure you like and subscribe. This is AB signing off.